You want to be in the driver's seat of your own life because if you're not, life will drive you. So, knowing who you really are in this space and time that we embody. That's number one. What do you want? Who are you? Number two, you must find a way to serve. Martin Luther King said that not everybody can be famous, but everybody can be great because greatness is determined by service. Now we live in a world where everybody wants to be famous and where we admire people for just being famous. We think being known brings us value. The truth is all of that will fade in time. In three years, you won't be able to name the housewives of Atlanta. The real truth is that service and significance service and the significance that you bring to your service is that which is lasting so to be able to whatever your occupation or job or talent or gift is our honorees today getting doctor degrees to apparently opposite fields HIV and AIDS and the spoken word but what they have in common is service, using the spoken word in service to community and the world, using your knowledge and information about HIV and AIDS and medicine in service to the world. And if you look at all the most successful people in the world, whether they know it or not, they have that paradigm of service. Using whatever it is you produce your product as a way of giving back to the world. When you shift the paradigm of whatever it is you choose to do to service and you bring significance to that, success will, I promise you, follow you. Service and significance equals success. That's number two. Number three, it's so simple but so hard to do. Always do the right thing. Always. Be excellent. People notice. Think of how you notice. You go to Taco Bell, somebody gives you an extra napkin and some sauce. You notice. You want to go back to that person. Because even at Taco Bell, excellence shows itself. Be excellent. Let excellence be your brand. Everybody talks about building a brand. I never even knew what that was. When people say, you're a brand, I would say, no, I'm just Oprah. What I recognize now is that my choice to in every way, in every example, in every experience, to do the right thing and the excellent thing is what has created the brand. And what I know is that when you are excellent, you become unforgettable. People remember you, you stand out. Regardless of what it is, you become an unforgettable woman. And that is what we all want. We want to be unforgettable and not forgettable. So doing the right thing, even when nobody knows you're doing the right thing, will always bring the right thing to you. I promise you that.